Hey, Brian Happy here with your tip for Tuesday. Um, please like us on Facebook at the Happy Amp page, and you can get these tip for Tuesday seamlessly on your Facebook stream. Okay, so anyway, today is all about protecting your assets, and uh, I want to make sure that you know that you may not be insured in a way that you don't realize it. You should have performer's insurance if you're an entertainer, um, and that is extremely important to protect you, but you may have a loophole that you don't realize that could cost you your house, your car, your business, uh, pretty much everything. And that is if you're sending performers out, um, a lot of entertainers do that and don't realize what they're doing and the risk that they're taking by doing that. So please be very careful. And also, you should seek legal counsel because I'm not an attorney, I'm not a lawyer, all right? Um, but here is what I have found. If you call a buddy and say, hey, I can't do this show, can you cover it for me? And uh, maybe you're taking a deposit, even if you're not, but they're representing you when they go do in the show, you could be at risk because your performance insurance will not cover you. Uh, the insurance to be an agent is about $1,200 a year maybe more if you can find it and um, it's pretty tough so uh, the next piece of advice I'll give you I will say please seek legal counsel be before taking this as the gospel but I believe that one way to cover yourself is to be listed as an additional insured on the performers policy now some policies require you to do that per event other policies will allow you to do it for the year, so you can ask them to list you as an additional insured, and then you're covered for their whole policy for the year. Um, otherwise, you may have to have them do that for each event. Every performer, every, every event that you send out, you'd have to do that to make sure that you are covered, because I'm sure you realize that when there is a lawsuit, they go after everyone. <laughs> so, I mean, if, if a prop falls over because of wind, hits a kid in the head, if a balloon pops and a little piece of the latex hits a kid in the eye, maybe the person you send out is doing face painting and they don't realize that their sponges uh, got um, uh, bacteria on them and they're spreading E. coli all over some kid's face. All of those things have happened and easily can happen. So you've got to make sure you protect yourself. All right. Have a great day.